Hey guys, welcome back to Chell Loves Wine. If you weren't already aware, the month of October is Merlot month. So there's a hashtag going around, hashtag Merlot me, and we're trying to get a bunch of people to use it to really celebrate Merlot, which I feel like once was a grape that was really popular, and then recently it's just been not valued as it should be. So I'm gonna take you guys through eight different Merlots that I've gotten in. All these have been sent to me as samples for the Merlot Me month. Um, I have some starting as low as 12 bucks all the way up to like almost 100. So we definitely have a range of Merlots. So let's go through them really quickly and you guys can maybe go buy some of them and enjoy your Merlot month. All right, let's get to the first wine. Wine number one is La Jota Vineyard and this one is from Howell Mountain. It is a 2016 Napa Valley Merlot and this one retails for $85. Next, we have the Mount Brave Merlot. This one's also from Napa. It's a 2016 and from Mount Veter. This one is 80 bucks. And I also love Mount Brave's Cabernet Sauvignon as well. They have really good wine. So if you find one of these, Next is the Cowboy and the Pilot, and this is from one of my favorite wineries in California, Trefethen Winery, and this one retails for 90 bucks. This is also a 2016 Merlot from the Oak Knoll District of Napa Valley. Trefethen makes great wines. I'm a huge fan of their Chardonnay. This is going to be a super fancy wine if you want to impress some people. And this is another California Merlot. This one's from Napa Valley from Piju. It's a 2016, and this one retails for 48 bucks. Here we have another Napa one. This one is a beautiful label, it looks gorgeous, and this is from the Grigich Hills Estate, another 2016 estate grown. Estate grown means that all of the grapes are grown on the estate, and this one retails for 43 bucks. So we're decreasing in price as I take you through these Merlots. So this one is our one and only Chilean Merlot, and this is from Casa Rio del Diablo, 2018, and this one only retails for $12. Really good value. I think most of the wines that come from this particular producer are really affordable and a good quality, especially if you're interested in trying more Chilean wines. This is a good producer to look for. And I know I said we were decreasing in price, but I lied to you because it turns out that this beautiful heavy bottle from Paul Mayer is $90, but this is another Napa Valley Merlot. It is heavy, heavy bottle, but it's a 2016. So guys, if you are celebrating Merlot month, I really think that you guys should try the wines, enjoy them. Merlot is a really great grape. I mean, they use it in Bordeaux after all, so it's gotta be good, right? As you can see, Merlots come in a range of different prices, so definitely pick something up that's within your budget. If you are going to post on Instagram, make sure you use the hashtag Merlot me and join the Merlot movement for the month of October. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.